everyone and welcome to the first episode of Let's Play Dorf Romantic. Now this game is new to the channel and it's also a city building game, but it has an interesting take on that. So it's going to be a uh, it's going to be very interesting here. So it's a very very simple game, although it can also be quite challenging and it is extremely soothing here. So hopefully we'll have a lot of fun playing this game. Uh, I haven't really tried it out. I did build a few cities just to get acquainted with the mechanics here. But aside from that, I'm really new to this game. So let's try to explore it together and explain uh, what we're going to have to do. And let's try to figure out a strategy to see how we can uh, get a pretty good high score here. So let's see. Let's just uh, get right into it, shall we? Let's get new game here. Classic mode will do. Mm -hmm. So here we go. So we have a whole stack of tiles right here that will connect to the main tile right here. And we have a water tile right here. Now it says two plus, meaning that this is the first challenge. We need to place down this uh, water tile right here. Let's just place it. And in order to get additional points, we need to connect this water tile to at least two other water tiles here. But we don't have a water tile now because on top of the stack is a plus three, well, let's call this a farming tile. So let's, uh, let's place that right here, like so. And we immediately get a plus three housing tile right here. And we can switch it around if we want to. And let's see, it has trees connecting to this end. But this is just plain land here, so that's not going to connect well. But it seems as though it doesn't really connect anywhere the way I'd like to. It doesn't have any water tiles, nor any farming tiles on there. So let's just... Uh, Let's place it right here. So now we have a quest for farming, one for homes and one for water here. Now we get this other tile here and let's see, it has train tracks on them. That is also a separate challenge. We could do this though. Or we can try to connect that house somehow. No, we cannot spin it around due to this rails being in the way. But let's do... Hmm. Let's try it like this. At least that one tile connects to uh, to this wheat tile here. And as you'll see, it says 3 plus. And as soon as we connect this one little farming uh, side right here, it says 2 plus. And as soon as we hit that marker, well, we can actually show that right here. Let's do this. So it connects two plain lands right there. It connects the farm right there. And that's going to give us some additional tiles here. Now the game ends as soon as all the tiles run out here. So we need to be careful to not have that happen. So let's try to finish as much quests as we can here. Hmm. So we have another rail tile right here. So we can either move in this direction or in this direction here. Now being that I'm going to be looking for more farm tiles right here. We don't have a quest for it, but hopefully it'll come along. I'm going to have to yeah, let's let's go this way. Okay, so another tile right there, and this is going to be connecting two sides right here. So one on this end and one on this end. I can switch it around though, but that's gonna not make it fit as nicely here. So let's go this way. Now we have a plus four 
housing tile right here. And this side is going to connect to the trees right there on this end. So that's not going to be uh, too good here. And let's see. It's going to be all housing. Now, we're going to need at least three houses to connect to this one. And four houses are available on this tile, or at least four. And this also has a four plus. So that's going to be two challenges done just with one tile placement here. And there we go. We get ten more tiles. That's great. That fits nicely. Connects the rails as well as one farm tile right here. So let's uh, let's go for it. So this is uh, a one house, one farm, and one forest. Can we connect that so it looks nice? This music is just so soothing. It's crazy. It's uh, I really like this game so far. Might want to do this. Yeah, let's try it. We have some more homes here, more farms. So this is interesting here. So the farm connects, flatland also connects here, just the, uh, the grass here. Uh, let's see, I don't really have an optimal, an optimal thing right here. So if I do this, it's going to connect both the trees right there and the home. And that's going to give me more points here, hopefully more than 10. Let's do it. It's so our first game. This is just a learn. Yeah, that's going to give me 20 points right there instead of just 10. And that's because two sides matched up here. That's great. Now we have our first force challenge. And it doesn't connect to this force right here. That means that we're going to have to find another spot. Maybe here. But that's going to get in the way of this... Uh, of these farms right here. Yeah, let's uh, let's do something like this. Maybe build a farm to the north, northeast here. It's gonna be challenging though, but let's do it. Okay, plus 13. Could do that. What are our options here? This is going to be also pretty good. That's going to connect that house right there. It's going to connect the farm right there. Yeah, let's do it. And now we have a bend. That's nice. So we could... Well, for one, we can complete the railway challenge right there. But we can also stay clear of that farm right here. So maybe I'll be able to build some farms on these two tiles so we can expand this area if need be. So let's do it like this. There we go. More tiles, more points. Great. So yeah, this is not going to be the smartest move right here. This is also not going to be good. It does have two farm tiles right here. But the farm tiles don't connect. There's a home in between. This is a good question. Could also, of course, go here. Try to get closer to that. To that force challenge right there. But it's also not optimal. Let's just do it. I don't see any other options. Hmm. It's going to complicate that section right there. Uh, 
only need three and I can still expand this way. Now let's go for the trees here. Right there. So we have another one farm and one forest. It's a little scary though. Let's place it here. Can we connect that anywhere? No. So let's maybe do it here. At least it connects two sides right here. One grassland and one farm. We got another low yield tile. It's also going to connect the two ends here. Yeah, I really need more farm tiles and more water tiles here. I'd like to leave this end open as well, so we can take the farms here and hopefully expand outwards, and let's have a second going out here. So let me do this. And hopefully I can connect this small piece of forest to right here, so we can expand our farming this way, this way, and hopefully be, we'll be able to connect this forest to this one at a later point here. So let's see, we have another water tile that also has a track on it. We could do this. That's going to allow us to connect this railway to this one. And we'll leave some room open here in case we need to expand on the homes. So let's try this. And our first style here is going to be two homes, two sides with forest, and one farm. The next one is going to be three farms here, and it connects a lot of different ways. So that's going to be good for here, hopefully. Yeah, no real options to connect here. Let's try something like this. Now we have our very strong farm tile right here. It connects two ways here. It's going to complete our farming challenge. That's also good. Yeah, both are going to be good here. Let's place it right here and earn some more tiles in the process. So we're at 44 tiles right now. There we go. An additional five tiles. Okay, this is interesting here. So we have a chance to close off that track right there. It does connect to grasslands right here, as well as there. Yeah, this seems to be pretty good. Let's do it. We can always connect the road here. Or excuse me, the rail. Homes. Great. Is there any way we can connect this? Oh, that's preferably that would have been a farm side. So let's do this. And we have our first forest challenge here. Or rather our first different forest challenge. And you'll see that it has 77 plus. That means that we're going to have to build at least 77 trees. And it also has this little flag icon sitting in the top right corner. That means that if we complete this challenge, we'll get a secondary flag challenge. 
and it's going to uh, require us to close off that forest. But we'll uh, discuss that when we get there. Okay, so this is interesting. If we place it here, then we immediately lose a challenge because we won't be able to connect any other trees here. Now, if I place it here, that's going to severely limit me in if I want to expand on this farming area right here. Now, these are not that many trees, which means I could comfortably build just a new farm right here. Any other place that might... Another spot here? No. So let's try to build a new forest right here. Off to this end here. We got another homes challenge. I like those. And it has some forest in it as well. Any spot where I can connect two homes? Doesn't seem to be that way. So let's uh, let's go for here. Only need five more homes. This is going to be four homes. Could also use this. That's going to close that off immediately. Not sure if I want to do that yet. Plus we have a very strong tile right here. That's going to open this area up a whole lot. just try to do it like this and it doesn't have a flag icon meaning that we can still expand afterwards there'll be no need to uh, to close off that area so let's place this one here and get a, a route out of this uh, already built piece of city of ours and let's have you right here like so now I need two more I can do that right here or maybe that way that means I can still connect this one Let's do it like this. Get more farming going on this end. I can expand the forest on this end and more housing here. Okay, that's interesting. Let's do this. Okay. We have more trees right here. Let's expand this forest on all angles here. That's our real challenge right there. Hmm. Let's go this way. Let's just try something here. More farms. Awesome. This will fit pretty good. So, I have two openings right now. Now I'll have three, because I can still connect to this one. I'll have a side right here, and a side right here. Actually, this is going to open like three sides. This is going to be uh, pretty good here. Yeah, let's... Uh, Well, I have two sides here. The same is going to apply to this one. But it'll have a connecting grassland tile right there. Let's go here. Another rail.
Let's go here. More trees right there. That's great. Maybe like so. Yeah, sure. Let's do something like this. I don't want these streams of water to be too close to the uh, to the tracks here. It's going to complicate things a great deal. That fits pretty good right there. There we go. More tiles. That's awesome. Yeah, let's connect this too. That's going to complete our water challenge right there. And a very complicated piece of track right there. Whew. Could also play it like this. Yeah, this is going to complicate things a great deal here. All those connections. Let's just do it here. Something like this. Okay. More homes. Let's just keep expanding here. We don't have any challenges, but that's fine. Forty three homes surrounded on all sides here. It's going to fit in there nicely. So it says 43 here. That means we're going to have to exactly land on 43 homes right here. Now, if you place it here, we only have two homes. So let's uh, let's do something like this. It also does not have a flag, which means I can still expand on this area at a later point. If we were to choose to go that route. Let's see here. Is there a good way to connect that spot? It's also a 56 plus tile. Yeah, this is. Uh, let's just place it here and complete that challenge. The two exactly. There we go. Now we need eight more homes to complete this challenge. And let's keep going with the farms here. Is there any way I can fit this properly? This seems to be the best for now. Maybe here? Yeah, let's do it here. 20 points. Currently sitting at 1740 points. I have no idea if that's a good score or not, but I'm thinking no. We still have 45 tiles here. So yeah, a lots of uh, a big home tile right here. Can we connect this? No, it's not really looking good. Yeah, let's do this. We have an angled angle railroad section right here yeah let's try to get these two to connect here that's gonna help out this challenge quite good here these homes are already all connected that's good this won't connect the homes but it would connect those farms but I'm really looking for homes here Yeah, let's try to get these two houses connected. 
Okay, another water tile. Mm -hmm. This is going to be lots of homes right here. So let's place that right in the middle here. We can surround this whole block with homes. This will connect for one to hole, the farm two. This farm won't connect though. Can we find a better spot? I don't think so. Could go this way. Yeah, let's do it. Okay, another section right there. And that's going to complete the railroad section. I will need to find something. I don't want to overcomplicate this. This is already quite the situation just by itself here. We could do this. Let's do this. Let's just give it a try here. We'll optimize our strategy at a later point. Let's figure this out first. Hmm. Yeah, sure. So, more trees. That's great. We need lots of trees here. This fits pretty good. Five more tiles. There, 40 points. That's great. Now we do need to close off this. So we've earned a flag here, which means we need to close off all these tiles right here. But we can do that at a later point too. They stack, so that's okay. Let's go here. We have another water tile, five exact. That's gonna be a little complicated. Because this track is already much longer than five. So let's uh, let's find a different spot. We can already start to close off these, I guess. Maybe here. Okay, that's one less spot. Do it like this. Mm -hmm. Like so. Farms don't connect though. Could connect them here. I have a tile coming up that should be able to do that. Yeah, let's do it. This one won't fit. That might also complicate things here. Interesting. Let's move this direction. So yeah, this tile here. That should be able to connect these two. But it has nine. Exactly nine, so that's gonna make me not be able to connect those. And I'd really like to have the tiles here. That's too bad. We could do this and then swing around. Or do this. It's going to make us close off also. So now we have three challenges right here. Still need to connect this one though. But we can do that later. Yeah, let's make this a long stream going all the way here. Sure. 
another water tile. Let's claim it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we need to close that whole section off right there. Let's do that. Perfect fit. 60 additional points. That's awesome. And now we have this tile right here. I'm thinking this is going to be somewhat of a special tile because it'll allow lots of things to move in there. So that's really going to alleviate the problem right there with the train section. Hmm. How do we want to do that? This is, I think, quite a valuable one. You could also place it here. That would be not so good. We can place any tile we want right there. That's interesting. Yeah, let's uh, let's take some time to uh, think about that. So yeah, this is a uh, Dorf Romantic. Really soothing, really slow game, but it's very visually pleasing, and the music is just great. It's awesome. So, let me know what you guys think about this game. It's quite challenging though, because getting a high score requires us to uh, get all these little challenges going. And they have just slight variations between all of them. And that really requires a little bit of puzzling here. But that's also pretty fun to do. So I'm thinking we're going to have to call this episode here because we're out of time. So I'd like to thank you for watching. I hope you enjoy. Let me know if you like this game. Thanks.